Hey what's up guys Faisal here and welcome back to another tutorial on our channel about Final Cut Pro speed ramping. So to do a speed ramping you have to have your clip imported to your timeline. Take an important note over here. For speed ramping most this kind of cases you make sure your shot is recorded in 60 frames per second because some of the shots you might be slowing it down to 25 or 50 percent so your shot will look a butter is smooth and nice to do that starting our the next step is to we'll slice up this clip into different sections depends on your own personal preferences to do that we'll select the area which we want it to be slow or normal speed and the areas that we want it to be in the fast we'll select those parts slice them in different sections first step let's see which part we want to slice up so I'm gonna play this part as I believe normal from here to slice up this clip I'll select this area you need to hold the shift button and press B as you guys can see it left a little mark over here it means the clip is sliced from here onwards then I want to fast forward all the way until this jet ski appears over here a little bit more I'll slice up this part again hold the shift and press B there we go okay the next part will be I'm gonna speed fast forward this area will be around 800% yes okay next thing I want to do is select a part where I will make it around 25% slower so I believe this should be enough not a very long clip so I'll just select this area press shift and B we'll slow down this around 50% will do but great next thing you'll identify the part that you want to fast forward so I believe I'll fast forward all the way until the end of the clip once it's turned from here I, it looks better yeah over here until this last two and a half frames yep so what I'm gonna do is select the clip and then hold the shift and press B there we go so this part of the clip will be fast forward around two yeah two thousand percent and this will be slowed down to 50% to get more dramatic speed ramp effect you can actually move these gray bars over here closer and the more you're gonna crop this the more quicker it's gonna go in and out from the effect so let's wait for it let's the clip to render and then we play it again as I mentioned earlier it depends on your personal preferences which part of your clip you want to fast forward or you want to slow it down and how many percent so let's play it back again see how does it look like slow and then fast transition 2000% and then slow moving the shores looks beautiful and stunning the last thing we want to do here is to apply stabilization select your clip from here and then click on the stabilizer over here it will make the clip look a little bit slightly more smoother and buttery smooth the last thing I want to do is reduce the time amount on this clip over here so to do that I'm gonna double click on this part over here it will come up with the source frame I'll just click on edit what you want to do is hold press and hold this and drag it on the left side so your fast speed ramping will start earlier there we go Once you double click on it, it will go back. Same thing I want to do on this side as well. We can hold on the right side a little bit. Should be, should do good. Yep. I think this looks perfect. So 
So let the video to be rendered and we play it again and see how does it look like. So yeah, that's pretty much it. So let us know what you think about this speed ramp in the comment section below. If this video helps you, please give it thumbs up and subscribe to our channel. I'm your host Faisal. Until then, peace.